Okay. Thank you. Okay, you need a pen. 702, I'm going to call the meeting to order. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I need to call order. Uh, roll call, please. Let's roll call. Call the roll. <laughs> Sit back down. We're going to call the roll first. It's my first rodeo. <laughs> hey, Mrs. Cocker. I was ready to pray. Here. <laughs> Mrs. Coons. Here. Mrs. Snyder. Here. Mr. Shipmatter. Here. Ms. Anderson. Here. Mr. Ray. Here. Here we go. Okay. Please rise for the pledge of allegiance. Behind me. The stage. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. And to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Awesome. Thank you for being here, everyone. Got a couple of things to celebrate this evening. I'm very excited for that. But uh, before we get there, uh, we have some work to do. Hey, come on. Uh, but I would like to invite everyone to stay after for some cake and punch, if you would. Uh, my mother-in-law made it, and it's very tasty. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're going to move right into uh, the motion to dispense with the regular order of business. Do I have a motion from council? I uh, make the motion to nominate more Cochran. First, we have to dispense with the regular order of business. Uh, that motion. Motion to dispense okay. of the order. Of, I'll second. Whatever. Regular order of business. Okay. For the, we have a first. Do we need yes. to like yeah, announce what it's for? For the purpose. Go ahead. For the purposes of voting in the council president for this 2023 year. Perfect. And Heather was the second? Yeah. Okay. Uh, roll call, please. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Okay. Uh, I'll, yeah. I'll abstain. <laughs> She's okay. abstaining. I mean, now I would like to make the motion to nominate sure. Laura oh. Cochran for council president. Mm -hmm. You could. Is there a second? It passed either way, but. I'll, I'll second. I'll second. <laughs> okay. We're all jumping at the bed, I'll Laura. Seconded, Laura. <laughs> Ain't nobody okay. want that job. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, we have a, a motion. We have a second. Any discussion? Yeah. I mean, I, I think it, it is essential. Here. I know that like you're you're leaving town a little bit here and there, but you're always present in meetings. But like because we have so much going on with nuisance abatement and things like that, it's very crucial. And I think it your continuance on that is is pivotal for this and this bill. So that's why I'm doing that. Okay, there was a motion, there was a second. I, I should ask if there's anyone else who would like to be nominated or would like to serve as council president, uh, say so or get nominated from the floor. I don't see. Okay, very good. Uh, so there is one nomination. There's it, there's been a motion uh, and it's been seconded by several people uh, that Laura Cochran serve for her 27th time as <laughs> council president <laughs> of the I village of Lakemore. <laughs> uh, okay, no further discussion. No. Roll call, please. I, I would like to say um, that Laura is has done a phenomenal job as council president. Um, she uh, she's good at advocating for the village as far as you know the things that a council president needs to do because a lot of us she has the foresight to go oh yeah that kind of needs taken care of and mm -hmm. and you know I don't know that a lot of us has that in us so she's she's great at doing that um, she does put so much time and energy above and beyond what is even called for for the council president um, yeah, you know, so I, I think this would be a great opportunity to, you know, recognize her for the great job that she's done, you know, through the years as council president. And, you know, I, I think that she would do a phenomenal job again. So. For the 27th time. <laughs> 27 <laughs> Which is time. impressive because you're so young. 20, yes. well, I'm 29. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. Oh, you've been doing this a while, Laura. I know. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Laura. Thanks. Yes. For, for Thank stepping you. up yes. for us, because yeah. we're, we're all like, go ahead, Laura. Yeah. Did she want the nomination? Yeah. Did she want the nomination? Yeah. She's yeah. the nominee. Yeah. She. She was. I, I didn't hear her go. Yes. I. I'm Yeah. So, do you. Do you want to do? Do you want to do? Yeah. I. I. Um. 
to accept the nomination. I will. Okay. 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 And oh. you saved us money. We don't need to get a new nameplate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank we you. appreciate you that. Go. Thank you. Exactly. Okay. I had a paper one for a while. Congratulations. So I'm like really happy about uh, that one. <laughs> thanks. Much deserved and much appreciated, Thank I must you. say. All right. And thanks and for the cake. <laughs> I'd like to make the motion to return back to the regular order. Of Thank, Thank you, Sam. Oh, second. Thanks, John. Any discussion? Roll call, please. Okay. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? <clears throat> yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. <clears throat> Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Okay, I'm looking next for a motion to accept minutes from the December 19th, 2022 council meeting as presented and not read, please. I'll make a motion to accept the minutes from December 19th, 2022 council meeting as presented and not read. I'll second. Thanks, John. Thanks, Heather. Any discussion? Roll call, please. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Thank you. We're, we're looking next for a motion to accept purchase orders from December 17th, 2022 to December 29th, 2022, totaling $13,010.37 as presented and not read, please. I'll make a motion to accept purchase orders for December 17th, 2022 to December 29th, 2022, totaling $13,010.37 as presented and not read. I'll second. Thanks, Heather. Thanks, Nikki. Uh, any discussion? Roll call, please. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Okay, we're looking next for a motion to accept the bills from December 17th, 2022 to December 29th, 2022, totaling $125,012.21 as presented and not read, please. I'll make a motion to accept bills from December 17th, 2022 to December 29th, 2022, totaling $125,012.21 as presented and not read. I'll second. Thank you. Thank you, Laura. Thank you, John. Any discussion? Seeing none, roll call, please. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mrs. Mr. Shipmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Okay, we're looking next for a motion to accept December 2022 DOPS delinquency report as presented and not read, please. I'll make a motion to accept December 2022 DOPS delinquency report as presented and not read. I'll second. Thanks, John. Thanks, Laura. Any discussion? Roll call, please. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Okay. Uh, we're moving next into the reading of ordinances and resolutions. Resolution number 7229-2022, a resolution authorizing the salary increase for Tracy McMinimi as the billing clerk for the Village of Lakemore. Now, therefore, be it resolved by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit, State of Ohio, Section 1, Council authorizes the salary increase for Tracy McMinimi. Section 2, Tracy McMinimi's pay will be increased to $16 per hour. Section 3, it is hereby found and determined that all formal actions of this council concerning and relating to the adoption of this resolution were adopted in an open meeting of this council and that all deliberations of this council and any of its committees that resulted in such formal action were in meetings open to the public in compliance with all legal requirements, including Section 121.22 of the High Revised Code. Section 4, this resolution shall take full force and effect on and after the earliest period allowed by law. Resolution number 7233-2022, this is a second reading by title only, a resolution authorizing the mayor to issue a proclamation recognizing school choice week in Lakeport. Resolution number 7234-2022, this is a second reading by title only, a resolution authorizing the village of Lakemore to enter into an agreement with South Summit Council of Governments. Resolution number 7235-2022, 
a resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into agreement with the county of summit for payment maintenance located in the village of lakemore whereas the public interest of the village of lakemore requires the regular maintenance of roadways located in the village of lakemore said improvement being referenced herein is the project and whereas summit county engineer and the village of lakemore desire to enter into an agreement to confirm the project's construction cost and to designate the county of summit as the lead agency for administration of competitive bidding and the village of lakemore as the lead agency for construction and construction engineering of the project and whereas this council has determined by reviewing all pertinent information that authorizing the mayor to enter into the aforementioned agreement with county of summit is necessary and in the best interest of the village of lakemore now therefore be it resolved by the council of the village of lakemore ohio section one the mayor is hereby authorized to enter into an agreement with the county of summit through the summit county engineer for its 2023 road paving and maintenance program section two a copy of the agreement is attached here too and incorporated herein as if fully were written herein section three that is hereby found and determined that all formal actions of this council concerning and relating to the passage of this resolution were adopted in an open meeting of this council and that all deliberations of this council or any of its committees that resulted in such formal actions were in meetings open to the public in compliance with all legal requirements including section 121.22 of the higher revised code section four this resolution is declared to be an emergency measure in the interest of the health peace and safety of the citizens of the village of lakemore therefore this resolution shall take effect immediately resolution number 7236-2022 this is a, a second reading by title only a resolution accepting the proposal from Hammond Tree and Associates for professional engineering services for Fairdale and Michaels Drive for utility and roadway improvements. Resolution number 7237-2022, re second reading by title only, a resolution confirming the mayor's appointments of Ann Snyder, Laura Cochran, two members from the fire department, and Clarence Bittner as board members of the Volunteer Firefighter Dependents Fund for 2023. Resolution number 7238-2022. This is a second reading by title only. A resolution authorizing the Village of Lakemore to join the Community University Education Purchasing Council of Governments. Resolution number 7239-2022. This is a second reading by title only. A resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into a contract with the Summit County Public Defenders Commission for a defense of indigence in the Akron Municipal Court for a period of January 1st, 2023 through December 31st, 2023. Resolution number 7241-2023, a resolution approving the fire chief to hire Brandon Beck as a part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. Now therefore be it resolved by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit and State of Ohio Section 1, Council approves to hire Brandon Beck as a part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. Section 2, Mr. Beck will serve a one-year probation. Section 3, it is hereby found and determined that all formal actions of this Council concerning and relating to the passage of this resolution were adopted in an open meeting of this Council and that all deliberations of this Council or any of its committees that resulted in such formal actions were in meetings open to the public in compliance with all legal requirements including section 121.22 of the higher revised code section 4 this resolution is declared to be an emergency measure in the interest of the health peace and safety of the citizens of the village of lakemore therefore this resolution should take effect immediately resolution number 7242-2023 a resolution accepting the resignation of Caden Hayward as a part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. Neither for be it resolved by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit, State of Ohio. Section 1, Council regretfully accepts the resignation of Caden Hayward as a part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department and thank him for his service. Section 2, this resolution is declared to be an emergency measure in the interest of the health peace and safety of the citizens of the village of Lakemore. Therefore, this resolution shall take effect immediately. Resolution number 7243-2023, a resolution accepting the resignation of Brian Seifert as a part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. 
Now therefore be it resolved by the Council of the Village of Lake Mer County of Summit State of Ohio. Section 1, Council regretfully accepts the resignation of Brian Seifert as a part-time firefighter paramedic with the Lake Mer Fire Department and thank him for his service. Section 2, this resolution is declared to be an emergency measure in the interest of the health, peace, and safety of the citizens of the Village of Lakemore. Therefore, this resolution should take effect immediately. Ordinance number 1797-2022, an ordinance to amend Ordinance 1746-2021, the pay scale for the Lakemore Police Department. Now, therefore, be it ordained by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit, State of Ohio. Section 1, Council approves the pay scale for the Lakemore Police Department. Part-time patrolman, $18 per hour. Administrative assistant, $17 per hour. Section 2, that except as amended herein, the existing pay rates and provisions together with all previous amendments thereto shall remain in full force and effect. Section 3, it is hereby found and determined that all formal actions of this council concerning and relating to the adoption of this ordinance were adopted in an open meeting of this council and that all deliberations of this council and any of its committees that resulted in such formal action were in meetings open to the public in compliance with all legal requirements, including Section 121.22 of the Higher Revised Code. Section 4, this ordinance shall take full force and effect on and after the earliest period of law by law. Ordinance number 1800-2023, an ordinance to amend ordinance 1743-2021, make appropriations for expense, current expenses and other expenditures of the Village of Lakemore State of Ohio during the fiscal year ending December 31st, 2022. Now therefore be it ordained by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit State of Ohio. Section 1, Council approves to increase appropriations in Street Construction Maintenance and Repair Fund, 2011, $7,000 for road salt. The ERA CRA Trust Fund, 9976, $700 for Hammond Tree and Associates for the Hidden Lake Subdivision. Section 2, Treasury for payments for many of the foregoing appropriations upon receiving proper certificates and vouchers, therefore, approved by the Board or officers authorized by law to approve the same, or an ordinance or resolution of council to make the expenditures, provided that no warrant shall be drawn or paid for salaries or wages except to persons employed by authority of and in accordance with law or ordinance. It shall be provided further that the appropriations for contingencies can only be expended upon a fill two-thirds vote of council for items of expense constituting a legal obligation against the village for purposes other than those covered by other specific appropriations herein made. Section 3, this ordinance is hereby declared to be an emergency measure necessary for the immediate preservation of the health, safety, and welfare of the citizens of the village of Lakemore, Ohio. Therefore, this ordinance should go into effect immediately. Ordinance number 1801-2023, an ordinance to amend ordinance, ordinance 1795-2022, make appropriations for current expenses and other expenditures of the village of Lakemore, state of Ohio, during their fiscal year ending December 31st, 2023. Now, therefore, be it ordained by the Council of the Village of Lake Mer County of Summit, State of Ohio. Section 1, Council approves to increase appropriations in American Rescue Act Fund 2053, $40,000 for fire salaries. Section 2, Treasury for payments for any of the foregoing appropriations upon receiving prop certificates and vouchers, therefore, approved by the Board or officers authorized by law to approve the same or an ordinance or resolution of council to make the expenditures, provided that no warrant shall be drawn or paid for salaries or wages, except to persons employed by authority of and in accordance with law or ordinance. As shall be provided further that the appropriations for contingencies can only be expended upon a pill two-thirds vote of council for items of expense constituting a legal obligation against the village for purposes other than the covers by other specific appropriations herein made. Section 3, this ordinance is hereby declared to be an emergency measure necessary for the immediate preservation and health and safety and welfare of the citizens of the village of Lakemore, Ohio. Therefore, this ordinance shall go into effect immediately. Ordinance number 1802-2023, this is a first reading, an ordinance to amend ordinance 1747-2021, the pay scale for the Lakemore Fire Department. Now, therefore, be it ordained by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit, State of Ohio. Section 1, Council approves the pay scale for the Lakemore Fire Department. Assistant Fire Chief, 
$19.50 per hour, captain, $19 per hour, lieutenant, $18.50 per hour, fire paramedic, $18 per hour, firefighter basic EMT, $15 per hour. Section 2, the dissect is amended herein. The existing pay rates and provisions together with all previous amendments thereto shall remain in full force and effect. Section 3 is hereby found and determined that all formal actions of this council concerning and relating to the adoption of this resolution were adopted in an open meeting of this council and that all deliberations of this council and any of its committees that resulted in such formal action were in meetings open to the public in compliance with all legal requirements, including Section 121.22 of the Higher Vice Code. Section 4 of this resolution shall take full force and effect on and after the earliest period allowed by law. Thank you. Okay, um, as you can see, we have a lot on this evening's agenda, business-wise. However, this is uh, traditionally the time that the mayor gives his report. And I am not this evening going to give uh, a report officially, but I would like to take some time to, to uh, talk about a couple special people at least in the room tonight. Um, the first person I would like to address is a very dear friend of mine who um, everyone in the room knows, everyone in Lakemore knows. Uh, she is a fundraising dynamo. She, things you may not know about her, uh, she has not missed uh, a food pantry day. She and her husband deliver food to our um, shut-ins and such. Uh, every food pantry meeting of every month. Uh, and we are very lucky and blessed that she does that. Something else that you may not know is that uh, she and her husband deliver food every Friday to the homeless and specifically homeless veterans and uh, others uh, who may be in need. And, and you've done that for years now. And uh, those are just two things that I'm, I'm not sure that everyone in the room knows about, but um, they should because your, uh, your heart, your selfless heart uh, to make people's lives better is, uh, is amazing. And you're an inspiration to, to so many. And, and I'm thankful that you're my friend. Uh, whenever there's a need, uh, you step in, you volunteered with others. Uh, to serve on the uh, Lakemore Centennial Committee. Uh, you serve in any capacity that's needed, uh, and it's never the glorious position. Now, usually you're serving alongside Tracy in the kitchens, <laughs> fundraising, whether the fundraising be for Rotary or uh, Parks Lions. or Lions Club Springfield or uh, Springfield, Cares. Springfield, Springfield Cares, Cares. Uh, the Village of Lakemore, and, that, and that's specifically what I'm speaking to this evening, is, is your influence and your um, positive effect on the village of Lakemore as a whole. You have been very instrumental in our ability to raise money here and your <laughs> willingness to say yes despite yourself <laughs> is, is, is a blessing to me and so many. So having said that, Donna, would you please come here uh, up front? I would like to present you with this, uh, this uh, Danbury clock. Uh, Jenny uh, put the battery in it and got the right time. So there's a, actually, it tells you how to get in behind there to change the battery. Uh, but what this says is 2022 Village of Lakemore Volunteer of the Year, Donna Remy, presented by Mayor Richard Cole. And it is a blessing and an honor to give this to you. Thank you very much. But I, 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 I'm, I'm not finished yet. Uh, there, there's probably others in the room that would like to say a few words. I know Nikki would. No, you're um, so this is the box. Thank you. That Maybe it goes Donna with. Would like to. Uh, do you want to say anything? Yeah. Um, I just want to say thank you for the recognition. Yeah. Didn't expect it, but um, it's always nice to be recognized when you try to do everything you can do for your village. Amen. Amen. Thank you. It's a good place to live. I love hey, it. Praise God. Absolutely. <laughs> But I'll have you know, there are at least five others in this room, several up here and, and, and in the audience this evening, that have told me that I need to do that. And I want you to know <laughs> that I, I was anyway. It's just fortuitous and, and, and interestingly coincidental. Um, you know, Nancy and others are like, 
Don is a superstar. <laughs> Vicky, all, I mean, all of your friends are championing you behind the scenes, too, and I want you to know that you are loved yes. by all of us, okay? Thank you very much for what you Nancy, do. Nancy, do you love you? Can I, can I yeah. say, can Nick, I say Nick, something, Nicky's, please? Yeah, can yeah. I please say something? Okay. I couldn't do any of this stuff in Lakemore without you, Donna, honestly. And I mean that from all of my heart. I could not, every time I'm like, Donna, I need you. you you're here, you're there. Yeah. And y people don't understand how much you do. And when I run into you at the thrifts and you're buying stuff for Lakemore and events, people don't see that. I see it. And I, I really just, I couldn't yeah. do without you. I love you, friend. And come here. I want a Donna hug. I just, I love you. You're a good person, and Lakemore is so lucky to have you. 30 years of community service. Yeah. I have a lot to learn from you, so I'm just, I'm, well, I love you too. You're great. Oh, you oh, being you? a five year old when I met you. I've literally been <laughs> 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 at Lakemore <laughs> Lake Elementary, right? right? Yeah. But where, where you worked, and now how, how yeah. life's come full circle because you're yeah. right back in the same building working. I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I feel like we all from Lakemore yes. know Donna from the, the fairs and the carnivals yeah, and absolutely. everything like that. It's a lifetime of, of It of is. It is a truly. lifetime of volunteering for Lakemore. But and for sure, volunteer of the year 2022. And not only does she come, I mean, she comes with an army. Yes. You know, yes. she, Nancy's right behind <laughs> you. Right? Donna, Donna, do this, Donna, do that. Vicky's back there. Vicky she's and like, Rob she's always and, dragging me. And her family it. and Andy. Are we allowed to clap? Andy? Yeah, yeah let's clap again. Yes. Thank, you. Thank you all for the husband who is always yeah. tagging along. Yes. Just oh, like Joe. Who I said poor Andy. <laughs> <laughs> poor Andy. <laughs> he's, he's being voluntold. Yeah, right. he's being voluntold. He is. Yeah. But he's a, you're a good trooper. You're a good trooper and you're always right next to Donna helping and thank you too, sir. He's a silent partner. And uh, like yeah, I said, pretty Jenny much. can well, Andy will figure it out if, if you don't, but Jenny will show you how to work that <laughs> clock. Okay. Um, yeah. and, and I will say this, um, with the centennials and, and the um, <clears throat> the quarter auctions and all the fundraising and stuff not a lot of people know this about Donna either she her and Andy spend hours countless countless hours like in their car that. going from guys? business to business you know asking for donations and you know they're spending their not just their time their gas their you know their everything that they have their energy everything to get things for the village of Lakemore. Yeah. So, I mean, it's it's a lot of work going and having a lot of, you know, being told no, you know, by a lot of businesses. Um, luckily, in the area, we do have businesses that, you know, that Donna is, is you know, knows the owners and things like that. But, I mean, with, you know, having the businesses kind of having to go out and, and expand and stuff, I mean, Donna knows so many businesses because she's been at this for years, yeah. you know, getting everything um, for, you know, the donations and things, whether it's food to, to serve and or whether yeah. it's, you know, baskets for the quarter auction and stuff. She does do a phenomenal job at getting all that. Truly, and there's no glory in the it, grunt. There is There not. is no glory there, in the grunt. Yes. And Donna is yes. the, the queen of the grunt. She gets it done. She does. She does. <laughs> Thank you. Again. Yes. Thank, Thank you. Very you. Very much. Right? <laughs> right? I'll find you one we'll at the thrift. Uh, we'll go back to things. Next time I'm at the thrift, I'm going to find her a crown. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to put a Lakemore, little sticker, a Lakemore symbol on it. Just put a strap around the clock. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Donna, Glory for her everything. Amen. Yeah, that's, that's true. true. And I, I hear that from you at school. That's what? true. <laughs> the glory for you, Amy said, was that you, you, you get to see the kids happy. being happy. Yeah, it's like in the day that you had them all sing happy birthday. Oh. They did the Aww. whole school. That's, that's what we hear all the time. Oh, <laughs> thank you for sharing that. Yeah. yeah. We thank love you. you, Donna. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And Andy, uh, we love you too. <laughs> and, and family. <laughs> and family. <laughs> um, and speaking of a uh, lifetime of dedicated service and loyalty and commitment and love for the village of Lakemore, I, I really I wanted to call this. Uh, my predecessor mayor, he, he actually coined it, Mr. Lakemore. I think the last <laughs> time uh, this fine gentleman received uh, an award here, and I'd just like to take it a, a step further and say, um, it's not gonna be Mr. Lakemore per se, but um, 
Thank you, Larry Kovacs, for your dedicated lifelong service and commitment to the Village of Lakemore, presented on January 3rd, 2023, by me, Mayor Rich Cole. But before, I, got, I have some words to say, and I'm sure others do too, Larry. But um, so, so I moved back uh, to Lakemore about 11 years ago. Uh, and, uh, you know, I, I knew you and your family, of course, uh, from being in Lakemore, right? My, you know, my whole life, per se. But um, you were everywhere. <laughs> you were the first person at every council meeting. You were the last person to leave every council meeting. You were the, uh, the first person at the parade. You were the first person to help at the food pantry and with lining up and packing boxes and, and, and getting, keeping everybody organized and orderly. And, and the, the amount of time and hours, and like I said, just the love that you have for Lakemore is, is immeasurable. You have a heart you know, the size of the sun, and it just keeps giving, 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 and it's so appreciated. And uh, there's so many people here that, that, that I'm sure have so much, so many kind words to say about you, but your loyalty and love for Lakemore just speaks volumes, and it's, it's a blessing being your friend. And I, at this time, again, I just want to thank you. This is, um, I, I hope you like it. It's, a, it's, a, it's another Danbury clock, so would you come forward and, and, and take this on behalf of me and, and the village for all of your hard work? and your love for Lakemore that does not go unnoticed, Larry. You're everywhere. You're our official Bible holder. You're yeah, auxil yeah. auxiliary policeman. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> while you're here, I know at least one person has something prepared for this evening. So while you're standing here, um, Chief Mayor, um, that's for you. I hope you like it. It's, that's for a nice picture of you and Ronnie yeah, to go yeah, over yeah. there. Okay. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> you said one people's all right. So. <laughs> 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 I'll put one off of Facebook. I'll bring one. <laughs> if Richard so goes over there and sees Jeez, those people, I will still there. there. Yeah. Like, Up here at really. the podium, however you, you prefer. Come Around front, it. sure. Hey. Hey. Thank you all. No, yeah. Thank you, Larry. Thank you, Larry. There is a certificate of commendation for all your service you've done for the residents of Lakemore and the Village uh, Police Department. Okay. Do you want to read it? Or you want me to read it? Go ahead. <laughs> He's He's like, 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 you are <laughs> you to read it. Read it. <laughs> for his exemplary and selfish, selfless service to the Village of Lakemore through his voluntary commission and the Citizen and Prevented Patrol, the COPP unit. Regardless of time or duration of call, Larry never said no to call to the call to serve. He will be missed. Enjoy your retirement. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Larry. Larry, we, 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 we can't thank you enough. I mean, I don't want to. Does anyone else have any any words to say? We're so lucky to have you. We Amen. are. That's that's it. Thank you. Yeah. You love Lakemore. You, you love it. He loves it's nice it. not having. An, you know, yeah. make sure that my name tag is upside down. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> he he, he helps set up for the Every time. Yeah. 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 I know. I know. That's that's the goal. I talked to your wife. I know. We we got plans later. <laughs> Thank you, for, no, about this. thank you for everything. Thank you. No, yeah, but he, you know he he has he has received the volunteer of the year award from Lakemore. Thank you, Larry. Uh, a few years ago, so. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did he literally just? Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course he did. <laughs> God bless you, Larry. Congratulations. We love you. Yeah. Another round of hands for uh, the two people in the room that we're honoring tonight. You guys are awesome. And that's, uh, I took up a lot of time. I'm sorry, but it was all so, this so worth it. it. It was so worth it. It's okay. Um, it's nice to be able to celebrate. Please, uh, you're invited to stay for Cake and Punch. We have a little, maybe 15 minutes of business left if, if you'd like to stay. I hope you will. Hopefully it's just. Okay. Did I lie? Yes. No. Just go. Yes. We're going to go back. Um, go. Council report. Start with uh, Mrs. Cochran, Council President. Oh, we're going to make this quick because there's cake and punch. <laughs> so, so thank you. I just want to thank my colleagues um, for yeah. having the faith in me to, to um, be the Council President again. And um, I appreciate you all. I'm done. All right. okay. I'm going to make it even quicker. Um, I hope everyone has a wonderful new year. Uh, I hope everyone had a wonderful Christmas. My family and I uh, had... Uh, 
so many blessings this year. Um, so I just, that's it. I just hope everyone has a good new year. That's all I got. Thanks, Nikki. Okay. Yeah. Miss Snyder, you're okay. up. I'd just like to say Happy New Year and thank you to our wonderful yeah. volunteers <laughs> that help make this a special place to live in. Amen. And my weekly shout out to Spectrum. <laughs> Spectrum 1023, we love you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for all the good work you do in our community. Good. Thank yeah. you. John. Oh, just like to there again, wish everybody, hope they have a good new year, um, safe and whatnot. Uh, thank you for the volunteers that have done. I also like to uh, remind everybody that our next council meeting will be Tuesday, January 17th and February 6th, each of those at 7 p.m. And they are right here at the high school. We no longer are meeting at the municipal building, soon to be Lake Moore Fire Department. Full bill. So with that, I'll go on down the road. All right. Um, I would just like to uh, wish everyone a happy new year. Hope that 2023 goes better than the last several years. Perfect. Hi. Um, and I would like to give a shout out to our road crews. Okay. Um, they okay, they yes. do a fantastic job. Um, we have one of the best road crews around. They've also been dealing with water main breaks and bad words. Yes, yeah. bad words, bad words. <laughs> so, but yeah, I mean they they do a great job, and and I mean kind of doing what they deal with. I think they're doing a, a great job. So. Um, the only other thing I have is the next council workshop will be January 11th and January 24th, uh, each at 6 p.m. And that is in the little chapel at the uh, Lake Moore United Methodist. So, let them eat cake. Let, let them eat cake. <laughs> <laughs> let them eat cake. We're good. Let's celebrate. Uh, can you just tell me where? Yeah. Anybody here? Okay. okay. Nobody, I don't believe that signed. Pardon me, nobody signed up to speak uh, before council, uh, so we will segue into old business. I will ask mm -hmm. Mrs. Cochran and then Mr. Strip to follow. Just uh, keep okay. it rolling. Okay. I'd like to make a motion to adopt ordinance number 1797 2022, an ordinance to amend ordinance 1746 2021, the pay scale for the Lakemore Police Department. I'll second. Thank you. Thanks, John. Thanks, Laura. Any discussion? Roll call, please. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Shipmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Koontz? Yes. Okay, I'd like to make a motion to adopt resolution 7229-2022, a resolution authorizing the salary increase for Tracy McMenemy as a billing clerk for the Village of Lake Morrison. I'll second. Is there a second? Yes. yes. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Is there any discussion? Roll call, please. Mr. Shipmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. That was it. Okay. Uh, we will now move into new business. Uh, we have three uh, items for Mrs. Cochran and. Okay, and then two for from. Uh, Ms. Anderson, so uh, if you would just carry okay. on. Thank you. I'd like to make a motion to adopt resolution number 7241-2023, a resolution approving the fire chief to hire Brandon Beck as part-time mm -hmm. firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. But first, I'd like to make a motion to dispense with the three reads. I'll second. Yeah, that's what I think. Take your pick. Uh, any discussion? Take your Takes five. Roll call, please. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Koontz? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Do I have a second on the original? I'll second, I'll second the original. Thank you. <laughs> you have to say it that fast. Any discussion? Okay. Yeah. Any discussion? <laughs> Roll call, please. <laughs> Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Koontz? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. There you go, Chief. We got you one tonight. <laughs> Chief <laughs> Rifle. Right Same hard as he's losing two. Yeah. yeah, yeah. One step forward, two steps back. Okay, I'd like to make a motion to adopt resolution number 7242-2023, a resolution accepting the resignation of Caden Howard as part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. But first, I'd like to make a motion to uh, dispense with the three reads. I'll second. Take your pick. Uh, roll call, please. Takes five. Mrs. Cochran? 
Yes, unfortunately. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Sadly, yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. I'll second the original. Okay. Um, thank you. Okay, roll call, please. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Regretfully, yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. I'd like to make a motion to adopt resolution number 7243-2023, a resolution accepting the resignation of Brian Seifert as part-time firefighter medic with the Lakemore Fire Department. But first, I'd like to uh, make a motion to dispense with the three reads. I'll second. Roll call, please. Takes five. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Ms. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Can I say something real quick about that? That that would go under um, under yes. under the three reads though the dispensing of the three no, reads. I just want to say something about Cypher. Yeah, it, yeah. That yeah. Would go, it's coming up. It's that would go in. Okay. A so I need also I need like a second. The I have my second. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we will open well, I need it. a second under the original. You just did yeah. that. Yeah, and now, now it's so open for Chief, comments. You'd like to speak? Chief <laughs> Rimbo, <laughs> the floor is yours. Captain Cypher with us for 11 years. Um, he was an integral part to the department. He is now the new fire chief in Seville, Ohio. Wow. So That's incredible. Yes, congratulations. For our department of, of what we put out there. Mm -hmm. So I just want to say some. Well, congratulations yeah. to him on yeah. his job. Yeah. I hadn't heard the job. great news. Good for Sad him. Sad to have him go. Sad for us because we all love him. So. He's a great guy. Mm -hmm. That's great for him. Okay. Though. Are there any other comments? He's staying on as uh, on the investigation team. Oh, wonderful. Oh, good. Wonderful. That's good news, Chief. Thank you. Okay. Um, if there's no further discussion, I know it's going to be a regretful and a begrudging vote this evening, but we'll proceed with the roll. <coughs> Mr. Shetmatter? Very regretfully, yes. Miss mm -hmm. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? If only saying no, Captain. But it's a yes. <laughs> Mrs. Cochran? Very regretfully, yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Miss Snyder? Yes. Congratulations on, on the new. Yes. yes. All That's the incredible, though. You can't be mad at that. It's not easy to be a chief. <laughs> <laughs> right, chiefs? <laughs> Okay, uh, Heather, you're up for two, please. All right. Um, I'd like to make a motion to adopt Ordinance 1800-2023, an ordinance to amend Ordinance 1743-2021, make appropriations for current expenses and other expenditures of the Village of Lakemore, State of Ohio, during the fiscal year ending December 31st, 2022. But first, I would like to make a motion to dispense with the three reads. I'll second. Okay. Good. Okay, we have a second. We need five. Uh, five yeses. Roll call, please. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. And I will second the original. Thanks, John. Um, any discussion? Roll call, please. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. All right. And I would like to also make a motion to adopt Ordinance 1801-2023, an ordinance to amend Ordinance 1795-2022, make appropriations for current expenses and other expenditures of the Village of Lakemore, State of Ohio, during the fiscal year ending December 31st, 2023. But first, I would like to make a motion to dispense with the three reads. I'll second. Thanks, Ann. Any discussion? Take five. Roll call, please. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. I'll second the original. Thank you, John. Uh, any discussion? Yes. Roll call, please. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Okay. All right, I have a, I'd like to make a motion to amend the agenda for tonight. Um, two different articles. First one is a resolution number 7235-2022. 
um, the resolution authorizing the mayor to enter an agreement with the County of Summit for paving maintenance located in the Village of Lakemore. <coughs> So your motion is to amend the agenda. Amend the agenda one, so we can for one item. Do for we one have, item. have two different motions? Yes, we have. Yeah. Okay. There's Three. there's two there's two, two from pieces John. of legislation that he would like. This one just wasn't included on the agenda, but it was a discussion of the third read. Perfect. The other one we have as a, as three reads. He would like to make a motion yeah. to dispense. Okay. Right. Dispense. Okay. Mm -hmm. So right now we're voting to amend the agenda to include this one only. Correct. Correct. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is there a second? I'll second that. Is there a dis any discussion? I, I believe our, our village administrator just explained what happened. It mm -hmm. just missed the agenda. Yep. And that's, that's the only purpose. It was. It mm -hmm. says dispense with the third week today. Okay. All right. It, uh, we'll call the roll then. Okay. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Schuttmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? <clears throat> yes. Okay, then I would like to make a motion. <clears throat> to adopt the resolution number 7235-2022 uh, resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into agreement with the county of summit for the pay payment maintenance <coughs> excuse me pavement maintenance located on the village of lakemore but first i'd like to make a motion to, to uh, dispense. <laughs> dispense with the three reads I'll second. It's a whole lot of stuff going it's on. It's a there. lot of <laughs> <laughs> Once but you start messing up, fine. you can't stop. It just. Yeah, I'm not thank, done. I got more. Thank you, John. Thank you, Heather. Uh, takes five. Roll call, please. Mr. Shetmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Koontz? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Okay. Okay. I'd like to make a motion. We need, we need to adopt it. You need a second. Oh. Yeah, I'll second the original. Okay. I'm moving ahead here. Yep. Okay. What are you He's doing? Right. I need a second. This is Thank to you, Sam. adopt. Yeah. Okay. Sam made a second to officially adopt it. Is there any discussion? No. Thank you for explaining, Tracy. Thank you for amending. John, we'll uh, call the roll then on this one. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Okay. And now I'd like to make a motion to amend the agenda. Uh, of course, ordinance number... 1802-2023, um, the ordinance to amend ordinance 1747-2021, the pay scale for the Lakemore Fire Department. I'll second that. Okay. Uh, this is to amend the, the agenda to include ordinance 1802-2023 uh, this evening. So um, if there's no discussion, is there, is there any discussion on that? The, the motion to amend the agenda. Okay, roll call, please. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stretmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Okay. Awesome. And then I would like to make a motion to adopt that ordinance. Um, again, that's Ordinance 1802-2023. It's an ordinance to amend Ordinance 1747-2021, the pay scale for the Lakemore Fire Department. But first, I'd like to uh, make a motion to dispense with the three readings of it. I'll second. Okay. Uh, takes five. Is there any reason to discuss? Roll call, please. Mrs. Cochran? Yes, absolutely. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Stripmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. All right, and how about the original? Oh, second the original. Second the mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, John got it, I think, or Mickey Martin. Um, any discussion? Awesome. Uh, no, I mean, the reason that we uh, amend the but or amended the agenda and put it on here is that way we can just have this and the police department in tandem. We just felt like it right. was important to have them both at the same time just okay. for mm -hmm. good measure okay sounds good any other discussion guys no? mm -hmm. other nobody okay no? okay roll call please mrs coons yes miss snyder yes mr Stripmatter. yes miss anderson mm. absolutely mr ray heck yes mr mrs cochran yes okay and anything else is yes okay yes. mine <clears throat> all right Okay, I'm going to make a motion to amend the agenda <laughs> to add ordinance number 1803-2023. It is not on the agenda. Um, Tracy is going to read it for us, and she's going to pass out the um, legislation. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Definitely could have been like an Oprah, like, okay. under your seats. 
Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Definitely have that. You get a car. You get, a car. <laughs> you get an agenda. You. Get a car. <laughs> Although this is unfortunately you not. Oh wait, this is a little passed out. Jane, you was bragging about how this is just one page. Yeah. I meant each legislation <laughs> is one page because, like, I have to like fold them. Here, man. You gave Tracy. I guess you could. Tracy have one. You could start, couldn't you now? Or uh, I didn't know if you wanted to, wanted to wait for me to have a copy or not. Okay, yeah, I can start. Yeah, I can start. Okay. There's K. There's K. There's K. All right. Ordinance There's number eighteen oh three two thousand twenty three, an ordinance upholding the mayor's judgment to terminate Michael Scrypeck from the Village Police Department and declaring an emergency. Whereas on December 5th, 2022, during a regular meeting of council, this council heard Michael Scrypeck's appeal of the mayor's judgment to terminate him from his position with the Village Police Department. And whereas the council heard sworn testimony and received a number of documents related to Mr. Scrypeck's appeal of the mayor's judgment to terminate him from his position in the Village Police Department. And whereas after careful consideration of the testimony and documents provided, the council has decided to uphold the mayor's judgment to terminate Mr. Scrypeck from the Village Police Department. Now therefore be it ordained by the Council of the Village of Lakemore County of Summit, State of Ohio, Section 1, that the mayor's judgment to terminate Michael Scrypeck from the Village Police Department is hereby upheld. Council's findings with respect to Mr. Scrypeck's appeal is attached here to as Exhibit A and incorporated herein by reference. Section 2, it is found and determined that all formal actions of this council concerning and relating to the passage of this ordinance were adopted in an open meeting of this council and that all deliberations of this council and any of its committees that resulted in such formal action were in meetings open to the public in compliance with the law. Section 3, this ordinance is hereby declared to be an emergency measure necessary for the immediate preservation of the health, safety, and welfare of the citizens of the village of Lake Moore, Ohio. Therefore, this ordinance shall go into effect immediately. At this time, I'd like to make a motion to adopt ordinance number 1803-2023. But first, I'd like to make a motion to dispense with the three reads. A second? No. Thank you, John. <laughs> We need to go back. Uh, we didn't have a second or a vote yet on your motion to amend, amend the agenda. Yeah. I'm sorry, oh, Laura. I'm, okay, no problem. I'm sorry, but uh, we got to do it correctly. Yes. Okay. So, so I'll that's second, what I second the amendment of the agenda. Yeah. Okay. okay. Roll call, please. All right. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Schrittmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. No. Now I can second make a three. motion. Um, to adopt ordinance number 1803-2023, but first I'd like to make a motion to dispense with the three reads. John, a second. A second. Yes. Thank you both. Um, any discussion? Okay, uh, dispense with the three reads. It takes five counsel. Roll call, please. Mr. Schrittmatter? Yes. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Second, the original. And... Thank you, John, for seconding that. Thanks. Uh, any discussion at this time on 1803-2023? None? None? Okay. Uh, seeing no comments, we'll call the roll. Ms. Anderson? Yes. Mr. Ray? Yes. Mrs. Cochran? Yes. Mrs. Coons? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Schrittmatter? Yes. Okay. 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 I don't... So, um, I, is there a reason? I don't think there's any reason, reason at this time to go into an executive okay. session. So before we adjourn, I, can I just, uh, I, I just wanted to say thanks to my wife for setting up the cake and everything. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thanks to your mother-in-law. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure oh, please yeah. stay. This is a, this is a, a celebration of, of, of two awesome people and so much more. An awesome community. You know that we live in and that we all love and uh, congratulations on you there's just a lot to celebrate so i hope you'll stay in that cake please okay thank you i'd like to make a motion to adjourn second second roll call please <laughs> miss snyder yes mr Tripmatter? yes miss anderson yes mr ray yes mrs cochran yes mrs coons yes okay Thank you. Thank you again, Donna. Thank you again, Larry. We love you. Huh? Okay.